Yep. There's a bite. What is it? Hey y'all, welcome to today's fishing trip. All right, y'all. Well, today, what I'm gonna be doing is I'm gonna be easing down these banks right here, looking for spawning crappie in these in this submerged vegetation that you can see here. You got some uh, some dead stuff from when the lake was low that grew up, and then you also have some live stuff, some green stuff that's starting to grow out here in the water as well. So I'm gonna take this little. I've got a eighth ounce jig with a little weed guard on it and uh, I'm going to stick this around in these holes in this brush and see if I can't find some of these that are on the beds. This water's about, let's see, let's see what it's about right here. It looks like it's about mm, two and a half, three foot deep. Uh oh, there was some sort of fish flounced right there. I'm gonna start on the outside and work my way in. I'm just gonna drop this jig around in these holes. I've got an east wind blowing in here. I don't know if that's good or not. You know what they say, winds from the east, the fish bite the least. Uh oh, we'll see what we can find. I got a 12 foot rod here. And since this cover's so thick, I got this thing spooled up with some uh, 12 pound line as well. So maybe we can get them out of there if they if they bite it. I'm gonna drop that jig down in there and I'm just kind of holding it just, I don't know, maybe two or three inches off the bottom. Hoping that we're gonna get it in around their nest and they're not gonna like it in there and they're gonna hit it. Water's kind of dirty in here. That's why I got that bright colored jig. Maybe they'll be able to see it. Ooh, I had a bump of some kind right then. You can come back for it. Another bump of some kind here. Sometimes when them crappie are around these beds, they won't necessarily hit your jig. They'll sometimes just push it around. You can just feel them nudging it a little bit. That may have been what's going on right here. There he is right there, though. That one came up finally and got it. I just kept messing with him. <clears throat> I had him bump it them first couple times, and he didn't get it. I just kept putting it in there, and that rascal finally got a hold of it. It's not a bad fish right there. Well, I'm going to let him go. Let him get back in there and see if there's any more that are hungry. That's two bump, three bumps I had in there. And just, like I said, sometimes them crappie will just nudge that bait and you won't, they won't necessarily eat it. You'll just feel them bumping it almost like you ran into them with your jig. And that's what happened. I, I felt a couple little bumps, and then finally he grabbed a hold of it. There's usually a bunch of them in one place. When you get a bite, you can usually catch several out of the same little spot, but you just never know. It can be pretty challenging through all this cover. It's so thick. There's so many nooks and crannies that they can be set up in. It's hard to fish at all. As soon as I got started over there on that bank, four boats moved in there. So I let them have it and I left. Now I'm on another bank trying it and we'll see what happens over here. Maybe they'll all come over here with me here, I don't know. That's not a bad one. 
we'll take it for sure. Let's get him back, see if we can get another one. I just keep going down through this brush and these weeds and dabbling in every hole I can. And if I get a bite, I like to slow down and then work the area over a little bit, but I'm just trying to look for active fish first. If I can get some that are active, you can settle down in there and kind of take it easy and you can catch a whole lot of them out of one place. There's one. There's something. It ain't a bass or it ain't a crappie. It's a drum. Golly. That nasty thing biting. Usually though, if I can find these, there's some crappie close by. There we go. Look at his face. Arr! Let's get him back. I think I have a bite or something right there, maybe. It's either a bite or a weed. Tangled me up. Yep. There's a bite. What is it? Another drum. What in the world is going on here? Where'd these crazy things come from, I wonder? I hadn't caught any of these lately much and then here I catch two. It's pretty. I'm gonna let him go. Well y'all I don't have any idea what's going on today. Um I tried everything I know of to fish shallow and I'm not able to catch them. I don't know if it's this east wind we have or what but um I end up catching two crappie and two drum so i'm gonna call it a day and try something else before i get too frustrated i don't even want to go back fishing no more <laughs> so anyway i appreciate you guys joining me i'll see you on the next one